What's up everyone, Nell here and welcome back to my channel. In today's video guys, I will be showing you how I am going to replace a camera lens of my Galaxy K Zoom. I will be showing you guys the step-by-step -step procedure from the start to finish. Stay tuned guys and watch this video till the end and comment down below what's your opinion about this video. Let's, Let's start guys with the package. It actually arrives two days ago after a few months of waiting. Finally the seller sent me this. takes two months because of the current situation. If you guys having hard times to find a parts, spare parts of your old phone or old digital camera i can attach the link down below guys of the shop or i purchase this one this is the galaxy k zoom camera replacement i'm going to use this one to replace my damaged galaxy k zoom camera let's go guys and open it just having hard times to open it This is the Galaxy camera replacement guys. I am not sure if it is brand new, but let's see if it's working. So let's install it guys. So I have here guys a Galaxy K Zoom. This one is already six years old. I've been using it for six years. And the camera is already faulty. We wanna try to replace the camera and let's check just to show you guys that it's already faulty let's open the camera it's stuck in the black screen as you can see guys the optical lens isn't opening and an error message definitely guys the camera is already broken we have to replace it Let's try to open it. Bear with me guys. I'm gonna open it, try to replace the camera. So let's turn it off first. There are eight screws. Now we need to loosen first before opening it so make sure guys that you already loosen all the screws because sometimes it's kinda hidden it looks like no screws in there so make sure to double check on that these points and the one in the middle so let's try and open it We completely remove all the screws. Time to open it to this special tool. This tool actually guys is free whenever you purchase a part of AliExpress. There will be your tools and small screwdrivers, precession screwdrivers. They are looks like disposable, but thanks to the seller anyway, they've given us free tools to be used for our DIY. So while opening it guys make sure we're not gonna break it anything from the lock so we are going to carefully open it i'll get back to you guys whenever i open it
Sorry, okay, guys. So now we're gonna remove some connections right here. Some clips. We have carefully remove it to avoid damaging other parts. So we have to remove also the flash, the capacitor, with the frame on it. So we're gonna remove first this signal connector and we're gonna pull out this HD flash so we're gonna try to remove this guys first we have to remove this small clip right in the front upper part yeah once you've done that you can pull out this HD flash totally Now it's already removed, as you can see guys, so we're gonna keep it right here. And there is a small clip connector over here, that is for the touch screen I guess. And upside, there is a small screw in the middle, so we have to remove this one first. And we can pull this motherboard out safely now, as you can see guys there are two terminals in there so we have to carefully remove that black that uh, stopping that flakes or ribbon we have to lift that up to be able to pull this old camera So already unlocked, now we can easily pull this camera out and replace with a new one. As you can see guys, it's really easy to pull out after unlocking the black color clip. Now time to install the new camera. As you can see guys, it's totally the same, so I got the correct one. We're gonna install this quickly. Just slide it in and then press the lock down, and we're done. We're good to go. So that's pretty much it, guys. But right now, we're gonna assemble it. Now we're going to test the camera guys I'm going to show you yeah, the zoom function is now working and the camera is working just fine and very clear no more errors 
so that's it guys if you find this video helpful please give this video a thumbs up and share and thank you for watching this video see you in the next one guys